NPC 8313E Power Quick 2 Pro Processor Freescale Semiconductor. Welcome to this training module on Freescale's MPC 8313E PowerQuick 2 Pro Processor. This training module will provide an overview on the features and specifications of the MPC 8313E. The Freescale MPC 8313E is an ideal low power processor for power and security needs digital media servers, consumer network attached storage, office and industrial applications. This processor provides more CPU performance, additional functionality, and faster interfaces while addressing important time to market, power consumption, and board real estate requirements. The MPC 8313E incorporates a unique configuration of the E300 core supporting up to 333 MHz speed with up to around 700 MIPS CPU performance. The L1 instruction data caches on and on-chip memory management units support up to 16 kilobytes of memory. High-speed communications support up to gigabit Ethernet and high-speed USB 2. The security engine provides hardware acceleration for the DES, 2DES, advanced encryption standard, secure hash algorithm, and MD5 algorithms. This processor supports boot options via NOR, NAND flash, CF, and MMC. The IEEE 1588 standard for precision clock synchronization protocol for network measurement and control systems defines a message-based protocol. The MPC 8313E also features a DDR1, DDR2 SDRAM memory controller which includes a 32-bit double data rate. The MPC 8313E has a low power requirement of less than 1.5 watts at 333 MHz in addition to fanless operation, wake on LAN, wake on USB, wake on PME, and wake on external signal support. Additional physical interfaces use RGM2 or GM2 designs with the parallel line interface between Gig E, Mac, and Phi. These interfaces utilize 25 traces running at 125 MHz or 12 traces at 250 MHz, respectively. With the new serial GM2, SGM2 interface, Parallel connections can be shifted to serial, allowing for longer connections and eliminating the need for synchronized signaling. The SGM2 format uses four or eight traces that all run at 1.25 GHz, giving a four times performance increase over traditional FIs. Additionally, the low voltage differential signaling format greatly improves signal integrity. The IEEE 1588 support in the MPC 8313E enables accurate synchronization of clocks with varying precision, resolution, and oscillator stability in distributed systems. It enhances applications that need local clocks at each control node and provides sub-microsecond -micro, sub synchronization over long distances using standard cabling. The hardware assist features that are available with the MPC 8313E processor include RX and TX timestamp capture close to the physical interface which reduces stack jitter and improves clock synchronization accuracy. Every RX packet and only necessary TX packets are timestamped.
Also, the flexible clocking options support both low-cost and high-accuracy designs with an on-chip clock and an external oscillator while the phase and frequency compensation circuitry enables slave clock recovery. Utilizing flexible recognition of the precision time protocol frames allowing for detecting and reporting reception of PTP frames and extensibility for future protocol changes and updates including Internet Protocol version 6 support. The external signal interfaces include two trigger input signals, two alarm output signals, three phase aligned programmable timer output pulse signals, and a phase aligned output clock. These clocks are defined by a best master clock algorithm in which each clock in a distributed system identifies the most accurate clock and labels it master. All other slave clocks synchronize to this master using timestamps. Hardware implementation allows real-time synchronization with nanosecond or sub-nanosecond synchronization accuracy allowing for redundant channels and switch router implementations. Also, the software included with this product can be used to implement a full source or sync capable IEEE 1588 compliant Ethernet code. The Integrated Security Engine SEC 2.2 in the MPC 8313E is designed to offload computationally intensive security functions such as authentication and bulk encryption from the processor core of the MPC 8313E. It is optimized to process all the algorithms associated with IPsec, SSL, TSL, iSCSI, SRTP, and 802.11i. The security engine can act as the master on an internal system bus to allow the SEC to offload the data movement bottleneck normally associated with slave-only cores. The host processor accesses the SEC through its device drivers using system memory for data storage. The security engine contains one crypto channel, a controller, and a set of crypto execution units. The power consumption of the MPC 8313E processor, shown at the top of this page, is organized by power state. D0 is the normal operation state where power is supplied to the entire chip. The D1 state is similar to standby and runs with the E300 core in doze mode. In this state, most functional units are disabled as well as memory and I.O. accesses while snooping remains active. The D2 state puts the E300 core in a nap mode where the chip runs on reduced power but the phase lock loops are still running and snooping logic is disabled. The D3 or hot state occurs with the E300 core in a sleep mode where the phase lock loop is not running but 1 volt VDD is still imply, applied to the entire chip. A soft reset enables the return to D0 state from this state. Also, if PME is enabled, context must be maintained. Specific to the 8313 family, the D3 or warm state runs with VDD removed from a portion of the die. The final state is the D3 cold state with full power down. When power is restored to the chip, it must go through the normal power on reset cycle. This chart shows power consumption in low power modes plotted against temperature at 333 MHz and 167 MHz core. SCB coherent system bus. As can be seen here, total power consumption is reduced as temperature is reduced.
DDR2 provides numerous benefits over DDR1 memories. In addition to faster speeds which lead to higher performance or higher bandwidth, DDR2 consumes less power due to the lower voltages required for the memories. Also, DDR2 eliminates onboard termination resistor requirements through the use of on-chip termination. This decreases board space and improves signal integrity. The graph here shows that one 1 gigabit SO DIMM DDR2 memory running at 533 megabits per second can save approximately 56% power consumption over a similar DDR1 memory running at 400 megabits per second. Now let us take a look at the development and application support provided by Freescale for the MPC-8313E. The MPC-8313E reference design board includes a printed circuit board assembly plus a software board support package distributed in a CD image. Development environments include support for general purpose embedded or industrial applications, media servers, residential gateways, and wireless LAN access points. The beta release of the Code Warrior 8.8 .8 development tool suite is available now on the Freescale Code Warrior website. This diagram illustrates how the MPC 8313E can perform the function of the CPU plus interface ASIC on a low end printer application. In this application, the CPU interfaces to the main ASIC through the high-speed PCI bus. Low-end multifunction printers are able to share the same platform simply by adding a scanner or fax engine. The interface ASIC provides the various network interfaces that are used to access the printer. Image data coming through the scanner or fax interface is sent to the main ASIC which processes the image by eliminating algorithms for image compression and decompression and rendering. The image data is then processed by the, in this FPU in the CPU core at speed, at high speeds and sent to the printer engine. Required networking interfaces include USB, PCI and Gigabit Ethernet. They're all integrated in the MPC 8313E allowing for the CPU and the interface ASIC to be consolidated in one device. At the same time, the system is required to consume low power. The MPC 8313E provides several power management methods to reduce power consumption. The diagrams illustrate how an industrial controller application is able to take advantage of the IEEE 1588 features of the MPC 8313E. As shown on the top of the slide, IEEE 1588 allows precision control over a distributed Ethernet network. Precise timing delivery allows drive units to be placed where required. In the bottom of the figure, Timing synchronization at the drive enables flexibility in system configuration. Issues due to mismatched cable lengths are minimized. Servos can be added or deleted without having to rewire other servos. Industrial control applications typically augment IEEE 1588 hardware to provide trigger inputs and outputs. In summary, we would like to emphasize that the MPC 8313E PowerQuick 2 Pro processor is a highly integrated device which thereby reduces the need for additional components and design time. The power architecture has low heat generation and extended temperature ranges for fanless operation. The MPC 8313E power management supports the ACPI 3.0 specification for low standby power. 
Freescale's extensive family of tools help get designs to market quickly and is scalable across the entire PowerQuick family.